Welcome back everyone. Today we're going to learn the best Indo-Chinese starters to serve all your guests after quarantine is over. Chicken sweet corn soup and crispy chicken. Take 250 grams of chicken and cut it into small pieces, ready to transfer it to a pressure cooker. Then pour two big cups of water into that cooker. Then take the chicken in your pressure cooker and set it on a stove for it to boil. Remember to take it off the stove when the first whistle goes. Now it's time to make the crispy chicken. Take another 250 grams of chicken breast and add some salt to it, along with a bit of pepper. And give it a good mix. Now it's time to crack just one single egg over it. Whisk it around and then put some corn flour on top. Give it a good toss around so that it all binds together. Now heat up your pan with a generous amount of oil and leave it for a while while it gets hot. Then slowly lower your chicken pieces to fry into the pan. Make sure you fry your chicken until they're golden brown and look a bit like this. After they're brown, leave your chicken aside and let it rest on some kitchen towel to soak up that excess oil. Now take another pan and set it on the stove with around two tablespoons of cooking oil. Now throw around two garlic cloves chopped into the pan and saute them for a minute. Then go ahead and add all of your chopped onions and saute it until it starts to brown. Then add all of your green bell peppers and the red bell peppers into the pan. Saute it for a minute and then add two whole tablespoons of tomato ketchup. Then add some vinegar. as well as some soy sauce. Mix it around so that all the flavours are playing together. Finally, go ahead and transfer your fried chicken into the pan. Coat the chicken with the sauce in the pan and then finish it off by sprinkling some spring onions on top. And last but not the least, drizzle some nice honey all over it to give it that sweet and tangy feeling. And just like that, your crispy chicken is ready. Plate it up and then add some sesame seed on top. Time to head back to the soup. Take out your boiled chicken and shred them into smaller pieces. And then, if your soup needs more volume and water, go ahead and add some cup of water according to you. Put the cooker back on the stove and then pour in your chicken, followed by sweet corn and then some salt according to your taste. 
When your soup starts to come to a rolling boil, put some corn flour in a bowl, mix it with water and add it to your soup. Immediately stir it all in so that your soup doesn't become lumpy. When the soup becomes sufficiently thick, go ahead and add some soy sauce on top, a bit of vinegar, and then add a generous amount of the spring onions on top. And that's your soup ready. Now it's the most important part, for you to devour your wonderful creation. Enjoy your crispy chicken and your chicken sweet corn soup. And that's cooking with Jenny.